I know that there will be a section of the people who will vote for the BJP, but that will be a vote for continued misrule, continued misgovernment, for a government which does not listen to the people. And I'll give you examples. You don't want the three linear projects. The BJP does not have a word to say on it. You don't want Goa to be converted into a coal hub. Even today I saw coal rakes being transported across Goa. You want the Malam sanctuary to be preserved and protected. Goa government has no word on that. You want the Made River and the other rivers retrieved and brought under Goa's control. The government has nothing to say about that. You want petrol and diesel prices to be brought down. The government for two years and three years did nothing and now says if we are re-elected we will bring down the petrol prices. That is a cruel joke upon the people. Look at what happened four days ago. The Mamagova Port Trust has become the Mamagova Port Authority. It is not a simple change of one word. They have virtually taken away the, Mamag the Mamagova Port area from the control of the Goa government and the people of Goa. It is a state within a state. The laws of Goa will not apply to the Mamagova Port area. Now, the answer to that is to change this government. The overwhelming majority of the Govan voters want a change of government.